Hi and welcome to Add More Zest with Diamonds. My name's Rebecca and I've got some items to share with you today from DIY Digital Art. They were kind enough to send me some goodies. So I'm going to start with the smaller ones because we know how much space a big one takes. And this first one I thought this would be fun for the little people in your life. Let me get into it. Now, of course, you do need to, they do need to be over three due to the diamonds, but look at this. So this is a little cardboard book and it is Puzzle Brain DIY. So we have a little ladybug to do. And then we have an ant to do, and it tells you what they are on the other side. Would be better if they matched, but anyway. Then we have a bee and a snail. Let's check I call them all the same they do. And a spider and a dragonfly. Then we have a butterfly. Then we have a scorpion. Then we have, is that a wasp rather than a bee? Oh, it's a housefly. Okay. Then we have a cricket, or they call it a locust. And then best of wishes to you. But I thought this would be fun little projects rather than it, you know, I mean, a book's nice, but little projects if you've got a little person in your life that wants to pinch your diamond painting. You do get their own toolkit with um, wax and baggies as well. Right. Baggies is the extra. Oh, it's got googly eyes. Okay, I didn't spot that, but we have number 12 or 11. A googly eye. Can't beat some googly eyes, can you? Okay, so we have some reds and browns, orange, purple, some yellows, blues, greens, and some more purples. So really nice array of colours. And then we have googly eyes. So we have some smaller ones and some bigger ones. So you can give your little bugs some eyes. Um, so yeah, I thought that was a fun project for a little one. Then, I can't remember off the top of my head what this one was. So let's have a look. Oh, yes, I do remember now. These are some little hair clips. So you can, they're pretty. Got so the little crocodile type clips and you can pretty them up with diamonds. I do recommend sealing these only because any excess glue otherwise would find a place in your hair. Um, we have a toolkit with a pair of plastic tweezers and then diamonds wise looks like there is three different types because I can't oh so each one okay each one you can do in a different color set. So the first color set we have a turquoise for in the middle then we have some purple and we have some silver. Now they're actually more coated in silver rather than the clear sparkle. So that could be set number one. Ooh, let's put them back in the right place, in the right baggie. Now you could of course mix these up, but you might not want to mix them up. Then we have we have for this one we have a big pearl for in the middle then we have some silver but then we have some clear so the first one is more blue based even though we do have the standard silver for sort of all around the edges and then last but by no means least in this one we have the silver but then we have a little yellow flower and some yellow. So you've got one with a hint of blue, one with a hint of yellow, and one that's more silvery, clear based. But I thought they were sweet little clips 
and another fun project that could be for a little person in your life but it equally could be for a big person in your life that's my opinion anyway so it doesn't have a number one it just has two three and four and they are little crocodile clips and then we have the big one so i also got a bigger painting i do like big paintings i like the speed of doing small ones but i like the effect of big ones and you're ready in fact i think this might be exactly the one that my mum is currently doing which helps because i have seen her part way through and it looks amazing we have a field of poppies some black and white and some red Ooh, and it's roly roly you do get toolkit two toolkits in this one in case you like to share as we all know that's not exactly what i fancy doing okay i've got it to stay down either side of me but we have 20 colors they do have dmc numbers And have a look at the top a lot of it looks to be 3865 we do have some 310 but that seems to be more scattered and of course we have a lot of red look at those look at those colors okay let's do a quick quick run through so we have some grays some browns which will go in the red and give the darker we have are they all the same they're all the same so that's or five packs of the same colour. We have some more sort of darker greys, browns and greens. We do have a fair bit of white. To be expected, it is a large painting. Purples, greens, this is your 310. So we do only have one bag of 310. Quite a few different shades of grey. Quite a few bags of multiple shades of grey and then some more red and grey so you've got a few different colorings there but isn't that stunning absolutely stunning so i will pop links of course to all of these down below oh let me measure this one actually so it says it's 100 by 50 but the actual size is 93 centimeters by 44 centimeters and it does come in round um, but I'll pop a link for this one down below if you can see a space in your home or do what my mum does and find a space in her home and then I will of course pop the links to the little book and the little clips if you fancy an off the canvas project for yourself or for others but thank you so much for watching and I'll speak to you all again soon.